Hey everybody, Phil here, and I just wanted to show you another demo of my personal project, Phil C. So what is Phil C? Phil C is a totally memory safe version of C, and it's so compatible with normal C that you can actually compile a lot of C programs with it without making any changes to them. So to show you what I mean by that, I'm going to git clone mg, which is uh, a little Emacs clone. It's written in C and I'm just gonna clone it from its, uh, from its Git repository on GitHub. This isn't a repository that I've contributed anything to. So we're gonna clone mg. Uh, so what it's, what's it got? It's got an autogen script to give us a configure script, so we're gonna run that really quick. All right, now we're gonna have a configure script, and the only thing we're gonna do to port this program to fill C is we're gonna run the configure script while pointing it at the fill C version of the C compiler. So I've got that installed in users, pslo, programs, LVM, project, deluge, build, bin, clang, and then I'm gonna run dot slash configure. So the configure script ran and detected the fill C C compiler and all of the tests that the autogen, that the configure script ran, because configure scripts compile little C programs to see what happens, all of those programs were compiled and tested with the fill CC compiler. So it's it's fully configured against fill C. And now we're just gonna run the make, make, make file. All of these CC commands are actually compiling MG with fill C, and I can just show you uh, some of the some some of what that means. When the MG program is linked, it's actually linking against the fill C version of libc, that's libpislinated C, which is based on, on muscle. Um, and it's linking against the fill C CRT, which gives it the trampoline to run the, ma the, the main function. And it's linking against libpislo, which is the runtime. And then on top of that, it links against libsystem uh, because libpislo depends on libsystem. So the only memory unsafe code in this process is gonna be uh, the code that lib inside of libpislo and then it's relying on libsystem just to make syscalls. Uh, so now let's run mg and see what happens. So th there, there we go. This is a memory safe mg. Um, but just to show you that like it, it's it's really running with fill C, I'm gonna uh, turn on the the verbose GC flag. So uh, you can see that if I start using it, the GC is running and it's screwing up the UI a little bit. But whatever. Let's let's use mg. Uh, to write a little C program. So we're going to put it into C mode. Uh, so now we're in C mode, and we're going to write a little C program. Uh, and you can see everything is working great. Hello, Bill C. Uh, so it wants to name the file. Let's name it hello.c. Uh, and then let's uh, compile it with the fill CC compiler. So that's in LVM project deluge build bin playing gotta run it through xc run because i'm on a mac and there we go we've uh, written a little c program using a memory safe text editor that i compiled with phil c without making any changes to it whatsoever that's how awesome phil c is you can make your c code memory safe without making any changes all right Thank you for watching my demo and have a great day.